Spring makes me feel awake. The light is golden, and the first green blades of grass are beginning to reappear. I love the renewed motivation to clean and open the windows to allow fresh air into a stuffy space. I think it's my happiest time of the year. A time for reflection and sorting. For letting go and making room. For starting fresh. Some of my favorite moments happen in spring. Wearing a t-shirt on the first 50 degree day after winter. Barefoot in the grass with the sun on your face. Crunching the last bit of ice on the side of the road on a walk. Iced coffees with a splash of maple syrup. Green garlic and chive blossoms. A sudden urge to cut bangs. A super bloom of California poppies after lots of rain. Trail rides through Griffith Park when LA is green. A blanket of happy little dandelions covering a field. Eating dinner outside with your loved ones. 27 felt like my spring year. I was coming alive again after a long hibernation. A year of gentle tending. Seeds that were sown, finally sprouting. A year of noticing happy moments all around. So many aspects of my life look very different than I thought they would. But there are also many unexpected things that are better suited and more meaningful than I could have ever dreamed. I trust that God's provision is far more fitting than my own. And for that, I'm grateful. My vision for 28 is that the seedlings of hope and meaningful projects and creative outlets would take root and begin to flourish with care and action. A plentiful bounty of deeper things. I'm not as I wish I was, but I'm choosing to be proud of the progress. I'm shedding the skin of who I thought I needed to be. That tough exterior shell. This is a year of discovery and adventure. Of looking for those happy moments. Practicing gratitude and trust. And putting one foot in front of the other.